Now we are going to write a small program in assembly using the same software and let's go to new contemplate okay and then we can insert our code here let's suppose that we want to write a program that will read a value from the keyboard and then compare the value to 5 and show a message if the value is 5 or uh, if the value is not 5 let's start showing our message let's do something like this move age 09 x the hexadecimal value then move in this case it's it, it we have to load the effective address then layer dx message one and then call interruption 21 hexadecimal well, I'm going to put our message in the end, message 1, and, and now we are going to read the keyboard. Let's put some comments here. And after we read the value, we need to compare thirty-five is the hexadecimal um, S code to uh, the key that represents five. And we are going to use jump equal conditional jump if it's true we are going to jump to this label of course that we know that we just have the labels when we are uh, writing our code inside um, the environment uh, that we use to program because we just have the address of each instruction but anyway just to, to give a small explanation about this well let's do this um, and I'm going to create a label called um maybe end is not the let's call it show message and then we are we are going to do the same thing that we did here the same thing that we did here right however in this case we already have the dx with the address of the message then we're just going to use AH and then call the option 21 now we have to, to write the code that show different message in this case we are going to do this and then an unconditional jump um, show message as you can see here if 
the, the if if you you tape five, then the the flag will be set, and then jump equal will successful, and then we are going to load the message three, and then show the message. However, if you tape a different value, then we load message two, and jump this code here, right? We're going to jump this. Then we 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 say jump show message, right? And now we are going to write the the variables that we're going to use right now. Um, it is not five and message three. equals 5 or it is 5 uh, now we are going to test our code let's click on emulate I will click on flags then you can see when you make the when we make the comparison here, we are going to see the that the flag that the flag will, will change its uh, its value. And let's run single step. Right. As you can see, we have the message here, value, right? Return from interruption then we are going to to call another interruption to assess the keyboard and let's suppose that we tape uh, for example one as you can see in al we have 31 hexadecimal value which means that when you tape a, a specific value this value you of course using uh, this function of the interruption 16 um, the value that you tape will be inside AL uh, and then we can compare AL with in our case is 35 let's see now we are going to make the comparison let's take a look let's pay attention to the flex as you can see uh, flags has been changed but the main point is that zero flag which means an equal value in this case uh, it's set to zero of course because we we didn't insert five we we, we taped another uh, a different value and in this case this conditional jump will fail let's see then we are going to load dx with the address of message message two and then jump to show message we are going to see it's not five and the program has returned a contract to the operation system let's reload our program and then we are going to 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 tape five now to see if we are going to see the the other message again value here let's read the value from the keyboard and now we are going to tape number five right as we can see here in al we have 35 hexadecimal value then now when we make the comparison we're going to see that the zero flag will be set and now this jump equal will successfully jump to equals five, right? And then the address of message three will be loaded inside the X, and then we are going to see the other message that it, it is five. Program has returned the control to the operation system.